and welcome back to my channel. If you're new around here, my name's Sophie. I make videos on lifestyle, cleaning, budgeting and organising. So for today's video, I thought I would do a what I eat in a day video. I've not done one of these before, it's a new video for me, but I thought, why not? Why not give it a go? And I guess it's a pregnancy edition, but I probably would eat this like without being pregnant too. Um, so I've had a little bit of a lie in, it's quarter past eight and I've just got up. Um, it's my day off today and I'm in all day. The only thing I've got on today is a midwife appointment. Um, I've got some admin and stuff to do around the house. Um, probably gonna film another YouTube video actually. Um, but I thought if I'm home, I may as well show you guys what I eat. I'm not like out or anything. Um, so yeah, we're gonna start. I normally get up and have a hot drink. Today I'm going to have a peppermint tea um, because I've got tummy problems and it helps <laughs> with that. Um, I've also got a water bottle, what I am gonna keep filling up. Um, I've had a little bit of this this morning. Um, but yes, this is cordial. I'm just a bit of a, not a disclaimer, but like, like this is my life. I'm crap at drinking water. Um, I know I'm probably gonna get told off for that, <laughs> but this video might help me drink water actually, but I have to have squash. It's no added sugar, so um, yeah, it's obviously okay for you, but I'm just useless at getting water in me. For some reason, our tap just has this horrible TCP taste and we do like decanter it and put it in the fridge and it does taste better but yeah I'm drinking my squash today guys um, so I aim to have at least like three four of these a day um, sometimes that doesn't happen but we'll see how many we get drunk today so I've got like half left now so I'll probably finish that fill it up again and yeah um, peppermint tea this and I'm going to have a look to see if I've got some bran flakes. If not, I'm going to have some fruit. Okay, guys, I've got some fruit and fibre. This has been an absolute godsend for me during pregnancy, but I actually love it as well. Um, and I'm going to have a nectarine too. Um, so, yeah, cue a time lapse. <laughs> Okay guys, I've got my cereal and my tea. I'm gonna enjoy this now. Um, and then I need to work out what I'm having for dinner, actually. Okay guys, I've had my cereal, my nectarine and my peppermint tea. I am currently drinking my squash and I'm just gonna sort out what's for dinner. So I'm just gonna get it out of my freezer basically. Okay, that was a bit of a task. Um, we're gonna have vegetarian sausages, but these obviously need to go back in the freezer. Um, the Linda McCartney ones, we're trying to be a little bit more like eating more veggie dinners. So we're not vegetarians, neither of us, but we're just trying to be a little bit more, you know, eating more vegetables, veggie dinners and stuff. So anyway, we're having these vegetarian sausages. I'm going to pop them back in the freezer though. Oh, I can't wait to get a new fridge freezer. And then, um, you've probably seen me batch cooking before, but I made this um, cauliflower cheese about a month ago. So I'm just going to get this out of the um, freezer to defrost. I'll show you it actually. Um, so I'm thinking of having it with sausages, cauliflower cheese and some like roasty garlic potatoes something like that i mean it doesn't look very appetizing does it but once it's been cooked and stuff that'll be really tasty and um, also let me know if um you'd want me to do like a batch cook video um 
I'd love to do that and to like give you some that's really cool give you some like inspiration and ideas of what to batch cook I've got loads of meals in my freezer that I pretty much just have them like how easy is that this is a fresh like I make all the hot like the white sauce myself um it's a fresh cauliflower cheese um, that I literally just get out of the freezer and cook it later it just saves me from like the faffing um but I might do a separate batch cooking video to show you like in detail of how I make things. If this is the sort of video you want to see, let me know in the comments because I'd be more than happy to do that. I think I'm going to do it anyway because I think there's people out there that will find it interesting. Um, but let me know what things you want me to batch cook as well. Um, see if there's some bits that I haven't made before. But kind of making like bits like cookie dough and putting it in the freezer. So... Like I can, if I fancy a cookie, I can just literally bake it and it takes 20 minutes and I've got cookies. Do you know what I mean? Them sort of things as well. Uh, anyway, I'm gonna stop rambling. So tonight we're having sausages, cauliflower cheese and potatoes. Lunch, I'm not sure yet, but it's still very, very early. Um, I'm gonna have a bit of a potter now around the house and I'll be back later to show you my lunch. Okay guys, I'm ready for the day. And I'm now on the second bottle of squash um, and it's not even 10 o'clock. So I'm doing all right for my um, hydration levels, I believe. This is baby boy. We're ready for the midwife, but we haven't got it till later. So I've got a few bits to get on with around the house. And I'm just gonna rest because I'm feeling pretty tired today. Um, but yeah. I haven't had anything else to eat yet. I'm actually not that hungry, um, but I will do in a bit. Okay, guys, it's lunch time. So we're gonna have some eggs on toast. Um, this bread's been in the freezer, but it's a Hovis seeded loaf. Um, so I'm just gonna toast that and then fry some eggs off. And that's it really. Um, it's probably, the most boring what I eat in a day video, but I'm just keeping it real, you know, guys. So I'm just gonna pop a bit of olive oil in the pan. Just heat that up. We'll get this in the toaster. This isn't all for me, by the way. Liam's having it too. I'm not that greedy. Although I'm very hungry now, so I'm going to probably have some, like a yoghurt and some crisps, maybe a chocolate bar too. I don't know if you can tell, but I'm very tired, like pregnancy tired, this has just hit me hard. guys that's our eggs on toast lunch um so i'm gonna sit down and enjoy this so the eggs on toast didn't quite cut it so i've gone for a muller corner these are just my fave blackberry and raspberry pack of salt and cup well pack of salt and vinegar mccoys and an apple i've just got back from the midwife and it all went well so i'm just sat on the sofa now with a cup of tea um and i'm gonna have a little nap i think just because i can and then I'll probably make dinner in a couple of hours, say. Um, but yeah, sorry if this is a boring video so far, but it's just a realistic what I eat in the day video. Okay, guys, so it's about 5, 5.30 and I am just going to prepare dinner. I'm starving and I feel like I need an early night. I think third trimester tiredness has proper hit me today. Um, so I need to just eat and just chill out for the rest of the evening. I could fall asleep now, to be honest, um, but I need to eat. I am hungry, so um, I'm going to prepare some potatoes, whack this cauliflower cheese in and pop the sausages in the oven too. 
and I'll play everything up at the end. Okay guys, um, so I've got the potatoes and cauliflower cheese. They're gonna go in now and I think the sausages don't need as long. So I'm saying that these probably need about half an hour, 40 minutes, and we'll see how long the sausages take. Okay, these sausages need about 16 minutes. So I'm just gonna pop them in a tray and um, cook them. After about 15-ish minutes, then the potatoes have been in. And then I might put some gravy on. Is it weird to have gravy with cauliflower cheese? I don't usually have that, but I think I might do some gravy. Okay, guys, there's the sausages. They don't look very appetizing. Um, oops, sorry. And um, I'll just wait for the oven to be ready and then I'll pop those in. So this is our dinner. Um, we've got roast potatoes, I did some peas in the end. We've got the vegetarian sausages, cauliflower and green bean cheese. I didn't realise it was that. And I've got some gravy here that I'm going to pour on now. I'm not going to lie, I'm absolutely buzzing about this dinner. Um, these are my pregnancy tablets that I have with dinner every night as well. So we're going to get tucked in. How was your dinner, Liam? Oh, so good. Right down to the last pee. <laughs> <laughs> so guys, that's the end of today. And we've just finished dinner and I'm going to sit on the sofa now and have probably a cornetto for dessert. Um, but I won't probably eat anything else now until tomorrow. Um, I've This is just a normal um, day for me. I probably should have had a bit more fruit, but I don't know. I think it's quite balanced. And um, yeah, let me know in the comments of, if these are any meals that you have on like a normal weekday. And let me know if you like this sort of style video as well, because I'm ha I'll happily do more of these. Um, but other than that, have a wonderful rest of your day, whatever you get up to, or evening, or morning. And I will see you in my next video.